My name is Gary Robinson. I'm a member here at Soap Archer Club here at Homebush. My accident occurred on the 23rd of June 2010. I was involved in a horrific helicopter crash in Afghanistan. So essentially, I've got no memory of the accident itself. In my mind, I'm still fighting in Afghanistan two and a half weeks before that crash occurred. I'm very fortunate to be the honorary patron of Defence Force Bowls in Australia. Remembrance Day for me is, is so important because it actually we, we probably don't give it enough kudos uh, at times, um, so it's really important. I mean, they're the reason we're here at the end of the day um, and, and enjoying life. Being in a bowling club where there are a lot of uh, veterans, it's important for me to mark Remembrance Day um, as to show my respect for the, um, you know, my community members and also my fellow friends that have served um, or are currently serving as well. I have family members on both sides of my family that have served. Um, I also have a brother that served in Afghanistan for quite a few tours. So for me, like, it's obviously very important. I remember this day for me is, is quite, quite an emotional day. It's probably the biggest day of the year for me. Um, as you can see, I wear my armband to commemorate my best mate who died in the crash with me. And also, every day I look at the poppy that hangs off my, um, off my spotting scope. The sport um, gives the, the servicemen a sense of belonging because they've come out of a, such a big unit um, and a tight family unit within their work. Um, so just to be out of there and then be amongst their mates in the sporting fields, it just gives them that sense of belonging within a team again. Most definitely sport as a whole has saved my life. It has given me that sense of belonging again. And I can see that the power that it's given me and the, and the um, the avenue has pushed me towards um, finding my feet again and, and getting back in the, in the regular community. Um, I can see how it could most definitely help um, ex or veterans within the community that are doing nothing and have had that, that bond and that mateship they've lost from, from being in the military. It is physically demanding, it is something that you can really focus on, you can set goals in and that's something for people who have come from the Defence Force, they are very goal orientated, they are very physically orientated. So I think it kind of fits very well with the lifestyle they've come from um, and it makes that transition back into normal society a lot easier.